Okay, so it's developer time. So I have this thing that I want to do, right? I have a monologue system that's able to say sentences letter by letter, and that's amazing. And so I'm like, yeah, that's great. I could make about 10 lines that say something super magical, but then, you know, games are interactive. I like them to have interactive elements, but the one downside to it and the thing that I wanted to fix was saying someone's name in the thing. That's my cat back there. It doesn't really have input for someone's name. How how do I change that? Wah, wah, wah. And so I, I thought about it for days, for weeks, for months, really just, you know, a couple hours. Um, and I, I thought to myself, well, if we're doing things by letter, maybe we should just like take one of those letters and replace them with something else that's a bit better, you know? Better letters, you ever heard of them? They're good. Um, and so I chose that letter to be the dollar sign because I'm like, when am I ever going to use a dollar sign in a game about money? This, this monologue thing is like a co-routine, right? And so it just repeats itself for every letter that's in a sentence. Amazing. But then I'm like, we gotta have it be so that this, this co-routine that is spitting out all the letters gets interrupted by another co-routine. How can I interrupt this thing so that I can do something else, AKA write the name? Names have letters in them. They have a lot of letters in them. Could have all the letters in the alphabet in a name. I don't know. I don't know how you speak and I don't come at me with that. And finally, I found a strategy to replace the dollar sign with someone's name. And that is amazing. So it's checking letter by letter. It checks to see if it's a dollar sign. And if it is, we pull some inception stuff you know we really pulled the code inward and we start another call routine that has the same protocol for checking letters because every name has letters in it right and so now i got it working finally where if i'm able to type in someone's name maybe it's mr magoo Maybe it's Chunky Monkey. Maybe it's my name, Dallas. Finally, my thing parrots it back to me, and that makes me super happy. And that's how I changed my relatively static monologue system to incorporate people's names. So now I can say, hey, Rebecca, how you doing? And that's, that's a beautiful thing. I'm happy about that. It's my TED Talk. Thanks.